Hi guys, welcome back to uh, Magic Farm with me, Sid. Um, where to start? Well, I've been uh, quite busy since we were last on. Um, this is my strip mine, which I'm uh, I'm just going to very quickly, um, hopefully, get to the. This is the last point. This is as far as I want to take this particular vein. Oops. Too much. Ah, damn. I'll stick one there and take that out. I can block that one off now. Uh, we'll have that. Because salt is always useful, even if it is rock salt. Right, yeah, so this is my strip mine. Um, I decided I needed a lot of resources, but not particularly that one, which is Cinnabar. And I've, I've done a couple of strips down, not too far. Um, got a nice little lava lake up above us there. And I've come down to, where are we? Y12. Um, I put stairs all the way up. Because, of course, Magic Farm is hunger modified and jumping consumes hunger so makes a hell of a lot more sense to um, put steps in and avoid unnecessary jumping now as you can probably hear I've got some chucky eggs chickens going up top here and it's daytime so yeah so my little hobo hole has expanded a little bit there's me uh, chickens nothing for me today chicks nope um, put a couple of bil bibliograph shelves in for all my utensils. So we've got a what was what we got? A bakeware? Mi no. What was that one? Mixing bowl, pot, saucepan. I think that one is a mortar and pestle, skillet, bakeware, and um, my chopping board. Some cheeseburgers that I stuffed in there. So we're getting the food situation pretty well under hand. I've got a whole load of fish. And I think let me just dump off some of this salt. And oh god. I'm running out of chest space rapidly. Uh I'll just ditch off those while we're at it, because I don't really need those on me. And we'll ditch off that. I'll keep a bit of cobble because you can never lose with a bit of cobble so yeah we've um, expanded out here a bit and I've also expanded my garden now these things let me just check for wisps this area is a pain for wisps I think I must have decided to support our fishing nets they're dead easy to build uh, in fact if I'll just bring it up on on here so you can see the recipe rather than me describe it but fishing nets are basically two wood six wool makes you a fishing net plonk them in water and they basically catch fish over time which is how I've been coping with the uh, hunger side of things more than anything um, yeah so they're really useful any wisps? no, no wisps so I've expanded my garden a wee bit and we've got a uh, that one, so, yep, tomatoes now. Uh, discovered there's a right click mechanic on fully grown crops. You can right click and it basically drops them down a growth stage for many of the crops. Oh, pineapple. Oh, what was that? That's something else. These are cotton plants which I'm growing because I want some cotton. Let's just run down the list, the thing here. Now this works with most crops, not all of them. So you see this barley is not playing ball, for example. Um, so we'll have to harvest that manually and replant. The primitiveness of it is shocking. <laughs> oh, right. oh, and 
I think we're getting on to night time, so we'll be running off back to our bed in a moment. I want these cotton plants to grow, though, because I need cotton. Okay. Right, let's just run in here. Uh, dump off my barley seeds. Now, have I got any more wheat or barley in here? Those chickens are going to be annoying. See? You can hear that. It's a bloody wisp. Right, so we got some bread anyway. And I'm just going to make up some quick bread there. Stick that into the furnace and make toast. Whilst that's toasting, I'm going to make myself comfy in bed. While that wisps out. And about. And now the other thing we need is... I really need to sort my inventory out. It is a complete and utter mess. And I've got some of these in some of these chests, so hopefully they'll they'll go in. Onion seed didn't want to though. Salt, salt, salt. Salt. And some raw beef. What is he, my raw beef? Sweet potato, avocado. There's so much stuff in this game. It is getting to the point where it's almost beyond a joke. I should have some raw beef somewhere. Raw beef, there we go. So, potato toast. And let me get this right. I think it is the skillet. Uh, stick that in there. Oh, no, I need the milk. That's what I was after. <laughs> Get there eventually. It's like cooking with Jamie Oliver without any of the flair or panache. Cream, butter. I've not got any milk. Come on, you must have some somewhere. No, nope, looks like maybe I turned it all into butter. Not a problem. I'll have to get some milk. I happen to know where there's a bunch of cows that I haven't killed. Do, 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 over this way. Can we see that wisp anywhere? No, it seems to have gone. Um, right. You are definitely not a cow. I don't think I need any more fishing nets, so I've not bothered shearing sheep like a mad mad person um, and I'm not cooking all the fish because there are some actual recipes that call for raw fish so it will be silly to cook them all now where's my empty bucket there we go so here we go excuse me come on Daisy give me some of that lovely milk thank you And more, thank you. More. You can keep this up all day, really, can't you? But uh, that'll be enough. Okay, so armed with our milk, we're going to head off back to the uh, kitchen. Well, like crafting bench, but you know, still a kitchen. And. Uh, but that took some good use, good good use. So, yeah, this episode I'm going to be aiming on getting some string. I need string. I um, need string to make bound leather. Bound leather allows me to make large backpacks. Uh, and the reason I want was that a wisp? The reason I want um, large backpacks is I want. more tomatoes it's just never ending this ah cotton cotton anything else no I think we're I'm not sure whether those lettuces are ready or not I keep on hitting them and breaking them and just getting a lettuce seed back so I'm just going to let that go for a while 
Okay, um, so if I take a saucepan and milk, salt and is it thick cream then? Hang on, let me just check some check check cheese. I want some cheese. So cheese. Ah, it's a pot, not a saucepan. That's why. So we'll dump that one back. And get the pot with the... That should give us six cheese. Take the skillet. Bread. Meat, that makes me so it makes A hamburger, which is a nourishing meal. Add cheese gives me cheeseburgers, which is a wholesome meal, and that restores a crap load of food. I mean, seriously, it's well worth the time and effort. Shh! Shh. Don't make me come down there. Well, you did because I wanted the eggs, but. Right. Where was I? Before I was so rudely interrupted. Uh, get rid of that, get rid of that. And uh, get rid of those. And we'll take the cheeseburgers and stick them oops, on the shelf there. Because obviously, you know, cheeseburgers keep better when kept on a shelf. Okay, right. Um, the reason I want this is because... Now, let me just... So we use on that. That is string or wool, um, and it's not very efficient. But unless I go out killing spiders like a mad thing, I oh, see. I could have sworn I had some of this, but it appears that I don't. Oh, I've got loads of salt there. That's fine then. All sorts of goodies, including somewhere diamonds. I found eight diamonds. Haven't decided what the hell I want to make with them yet, but I found diamonds. Now, oops. The other thing I spot. Oh, my eggplants are ready as well. Now look, I'm more cotton, so I can make a bit more string. But I need a lot more string. The other thing I wanted to go and check out is I spotted this the other day while I was wandering around out here. And that is a spider tree. Uh, and by which I mean there's a spider spawner under it. So I'm going to eat that, which gives me this well fed effect. Grab my axe, my trusty axe, and get in there quick before. That bloody thing can spawn. I knew this was a spider tree because they're webs. And if I go for those, I can get their stringy goodness. Not as much as I would have. Oh dear. Let me uh, block that up. I don't want to fall down there in a hurry. What have we got in here? Oh, some more string. Iron. Infinity, that could be useful. A saddle, not so much useful. Cocoa beans and some bread. Uh, in fact, waste not, want not. I'm going to have the chest as well. Now, is there any more string to be uh, webs on this tree? Um, yeah, I knew, I know. Oh, yes, these loads, good. I know these particular trees evolved from F standard FTB, um, as I've come across them there, but the unsuspecting could have had quite a nasty, sp ooh, nice, spider-related experience with that, I think. Um, any more? Any more for any more? No, you tight gits. Okay, yeah, right. 
getting sidetracked again. So, the other thing I learned uh, whilst playing the hours or so that I played off of camera, um, let's go and see if we can find one of these trees with hanging dangly fruit, if you'll pardon the expression. These fruit, I've been bang, 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 banging them off. Right click them, the fruit remains, and it drops its contents. Same with the apples. So you can just right click those and get the food that way. And similarly, if I head over this way, I found all sorts of strange little devices. I can't tell what time it is actually, is it? Surely the day's not over already. Let me uh, try and get a better vantage point. It is an all. Alright, let's go and have a quick sleep then. Well, if I can find my way back to the uh, hidey hole. So yeah, I've got the hunger dynamic here pretty much now at a controllable level um, I wouldn't want to have to go particularly long distance but we'll just get that sleep out of the way uh, dump a load more of this I'm full again I've got some I know I've got some string in one of these chests, so that can go in there. Should have some iron somewhere else. There we go. Uh, in fact, I had a chest, didn't I? So where the hell to put it though? There for now, <laughs> for want of a better place. Yeah, so. The reason I'm wanting string is to make large backpacks, um, which are the equivalent to a double chest. And the reason I'm wanting large backpacks is the wisps. I figure that I am pretty much living on top of a Vs node, which is why they're spawning so frequently around me. Because um, obviously I'm not doing anything with Thormcraft. Ooh. Um, so I think the ore is building up and it's spawning itself as wisps which are basically coming and attacking the crap out of me um, and I don't like wisps 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 have got a particularly unpleasant ability and that is that they can completely ignore armour or they certainly seem to anyway now, I did notice hanging from some of these jungle trees something in addition to the usual cocoa beans. I'm just trying to see if I can find any more. Because they were, I can't remember what they were now, but they were like little, little fruit things very similar to the so we got, oh, these are new, I've not seen these, what are they? Are any of them ripe? No, okay. I'll not destroy any more, because I may want those. At a later date, to make some culinary delight. But somewhere around here, there must be few of those other things. So yeah, so jungle trees have fruit as well, which was interesting to know. I just can't seem to find any at the moment. Okay, we'll uh, wander on. Yes, yeah, so I want the large backpack to move and I want to find a, a nice peaceful plains biome area perhaps. Oop, no, I don't want to go that way. No. I want to go there. Stop it. Because um, obviously I've got a hell of a lot of stuff now. And every time I go out I seem to end up with more stuff. 
than the last time. And what I'd like to do is to get myself set up with a a house which um, is equipped with things like hot house. I'm not really bothered about any more cocoa beans. I've still got some of those back at the house anyway. I'm just interested in having a little fertile round, seeing what other interesting things we can find growing in the jungle. Yeah, I'd like to get like a hot house greenhouse affair going and uh, you know things along those lines I can't find those damn little I think they were like chilies or something they were definitely there so that one's not grown peppercorns that was it I think it's a condiment just used in some dishes, but um, hey, let's take what nature provides, eh? Uh, also around here, apart from being a honking great hulk, hmm. very random oh well got it nothing ha bad happened <laughs> distrustful as ever you know there's an old saying when something seems too good to be true it probably is and to be honest, in most cases, I've rarely found that to be actually wrong. <laughs> um, you know, someone comes and offers you a state-of-the-art laptop for 50 quid. It's almost certainly not legit. Uh, there's a nice silverwood tree, so that's definitely where the one or a node is probably situated oh incidentally they were avocados off the tree there and it'd be useful to find out if you can actually harvest those trees that grow the fruit or whether it's just a random you grow a tree and fruit spawn on it or what because at the moment these fruit trees are scattered quite widely around me and uh, I mean I know there should be another apple tree somewhere around here can I find it no but I have found that nutmeg tree again oh there's Whee. nutmeg apple Anything else while well, I'm out looking? So yeah, I need string. Um, as I say, short of going picking fights with spiders. Um, whoa! Don't look at him. <laughs> Better not be nicking my farmland. Okay. A bit more cotton down there as well, but I don't think that's enough to make enough hardened leather because you need eight. Right, so that's corn. Oh, that was like that was definitely lettuce. Uh, I've got a corn seed. See, that's wheat, which we can harvest with a right click. That's barley, which we can't. But it does seem to grow faster. Eggplant. And some more barley. That's not ready. Those were. Anything else ready down there? 
that rice. I've got no idea if that's doing anything. Maybe the wrong biome for it. Um, the other thing this mod does do is slows down the growth. <sighs> Full inventory. That's the other thing you see, I'm just getting inventory which is completely full pretty much every time I come back. And then you have to sit there and find out what the hell you can store in what place. Do rotten flesh cantaloupes. Right, what else can we store any of this? Apples, cantaloupes, rotten flesh, cotton, avocados, they're somewhere. Avocados, peppercorn, where's my cotton? Right, we'll have that. Store that, that and that. Got nowhere to store that one. Right, so that lot can just go in there for now. And I think I should have my string. Leather. Leather. So, armed with 12 string. Armed with a 12 string, which and I need. So I'm sure that was it. Okay, let's have a look. Leather, hardened leather, candleberry wax. Can we use that for? I thought it was toughened. Oh, that was just it wasn't hardened leather. It was is it bound. Yeah. Hide? No. Right back. Oh, oh. So maybe I'm not getting the same options. The wiki was obviously fibbing to me. I'm not going to get any of those in a hurry. Now what about bags? Wove golden bag of holding. Ooh. Alchemical bag. Knapsack. Gold, iron tough tool rod. All right. Hmm. That's one to check up on, I think. Maybe I'm going to have to uh, come up with a different strategy. Because <laughs> I want to transport all of this stuff, and I don't want to have to go backwards and forwards too much. Really don't want to go backwards and forwards too much. Let's cook some. F let's cook them fish. Not short of coal, so. Hmm. So we've got a backpack slot. So why is? Let me just try this. See, that's the normal recipe for a backpack in Hexit. Mm, gonna have to consult on that one I think. Um, it's obviously I've been misled by the wiki. Damn it. Right. Um, alternative plans. So yeah, we've got food thoroughly under control as you can see. half paranoid listening for that sound of them damn wisps. 
Well, if I don't need the string for bound leather, then uh, I can make myself a bow, can't I? Which I suppose is better than a kick in the chops. Tomatoes, eggplants. I've got so much food now, it's actually getting silly. <laughs> Right, I think we know. Thank you for your eggs. Oh, it's always the same, you go and collect the eggs and pop. So what I need to do is decide of an easy way to transport all of this stuff. And That just needs a hell of a lot of gold and chest and wool. And I've got eight, so I need nine to make the block. I basically need four more. I'm going to go and... Uh, ooh. Did I hear the pitter-patter of tiny spidery feet there? Yes. What are you doing out? Huh? We saw then just how fast the hunger goes down from combat. <laughs> uh, right. As I was saying, I'm going to go and run a little strip mine and see if I can't get enough gold to do that. I've also been got some rubber which uh, will come in later I'm sure you will see see that's confused me now the butter and the cheese because it looks a bit goldish right yep back in a short ok um, did a little mining trip found a little bit of gold seriously a little bit of gold um, a whole load of lapis and stuff um, coal, but nowhere near as much gold as I would have liked. So, let's go wander up and smelt this stuff and find out what this bag of holding does. And if it's a complete waste of time, I will be a bit out, I'll be annoyed. Um, but if it's hopefully it'll hold something. <laughs> If it will hold enough, then I'll just need to go gold hunting, get enough to build multiples. Let's have a sleep. Right. Come on, come on. Um, oh, more eggies. And the lovely sound of something burning to death. There's no finer sound in the world. Chuck that lapis in there. In fact, if we get the lapis out, we can turn it into blocks, which will be a little bit easier to manage. We do the same with the redstone, actually. Do 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 redstone, give me the redstone. All that lovely, lovely redstone. I think I can do the same with some of these foods actually as well if I've got enough of them. Hmm. Anyway. That's for another time. should make the inventory a little bit easier to manage while that gold is cooking. Now I know this is 1.52 so there's no point trying to get clever with the uh, coal. But still, that's uh, some inventory freed up. Got the gold. Some more, oops. More gold. Okay, let's make a block. And what was it? 
wool, gold, and a chest. There's a chest. Have I got any wool? Yes. Perfect. Chest. Gold. Gold block. And... And we get a bag of holding. What does it do? Oh, wow. Totally worthwhile. <laughs> okay, we need gold. We need lots of gold. Because... That is the answer to all my storage nightmares. As if I... No. Okay. Cheeseburgers off, bag of holding on. <laughs> right, well we have a mission. All we've got to do is run out here quickly. The only thing I don't like is with... Uh, hello there. cotton now. I need gold. <laughs> and gold I can get just by mining. Which I suppose is nice. What else have we got? Anything else grown there? Okay, let's go and uh, do that. So yeah, you can see we're we're getting on. We're having a bit of fun with this now. We've got we got all these great foods, tomatoes and stuff, and you know I can use a tomato, for example, to well I can use two tomatoes to make two tomatoes. That seems so. Yeah, that was it. You can. Create crates when you've got nine. Um, mix spaghetti, tomato soup, ketchup. Um, now there is BLT, which is basically that one, and you can make the deluxe cheeseburger, which is lettuce, tomato, and cheeseburger. In fact, I think I had some lettuce. I'm going to make some deluxe cheeseburgers before I finish. I'm going to finish on a recipe got my cheeseburgers got tomatoes where did I put the lettuce? lettuce there we go, lettuce that can go in there uh, tomatoes, tomatoes, I want three of those and just get rid of some of this into there take that out while we're at it, get rid of whatever we can. And let's see, so we've got a wholesome meal. And add in that to make a deluxe cheeseburger. Mm-mm. Now, I'm not going to waste that and just eat it when I've got two bars of hunger. That would be silly. Really do need to sort this crap out though sometime. Mm. Uh, gold, coal, iron. Actually, I'm not even bothered about that flint, um, that stuff to be honest. Mm. 
Okay. Well, I think I'll call it a day at that for now. Um, my mission is to get gold. So, hopefully by the next time we're on we'll have enough of those to take the contents of this lot and that garden. And uh, we'll be able to move on and find a more permanent residence. So that's been me, Sid, playing Magic Farm, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye!